Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Dex and in today's video we're going to be talking about Smoke and Tachanka. And we're going to see who's who's better now since Tachanka's buff and how Smoke has always been there. But yeah, sit back and enjoy the video. Like, subscribe, do all that. If you agree with me or disagree with me, leave that in the comments below. We can talk about it. And yeah, social media should be displayed. And let's get into it. Smoke is a 2 speed, 2 health operator. His primary weapons include the M590A1 shotgun, the FMJ9 submachine gun. His secondary weapons include the SMG11 machine pistol and the P226 MK25 pistol. His utility includes a deployable shield or barbed wire. Now, Smoke's role on the team is plant and area denial. Smoke's strongest kit as of right now is the M590A1 shotgun as the primary and then the SMG-11 machine pistol as the secondary. Smoke's gadget is the remote gas bomb or the RGB. The remote- the gas bomb is a throwable gadget that can kill attackers and defenders alike and shuts down an entire area. Smoke is immune to his own gadget. The developers tried to taking that away and the community backlash was too much so they never did. Tachanka is a 1 speed 3 health operator. His primary weapons include the DP-27 light machine gun, the 9x19 VSN submachine gun. His secondary weapon inclu includes the Bearing 9 machine pistol, the PMM pistol, GSH-19 pistol. His utility is a deployable shield and some barbed wire. Tachanka's role on the team is area and plant denial. Tachanka's current kit is the DP-27 light machine gun as the primary and the Bearing 9 machine pistol as the secondary. The utility is going to be the deployable shield. His gadget is a Shaquisha launcher. The launcher is it fires fire grenades that can kill attackers and defenders and shut down huge areas of them. Smoke's gadget lasts for 10 seconds apiece. With three total gadgets, the total length of the smokes will be for 30 seconds. Tonka's launcher holds seven shots in the magazine. He has 14 total shots. Each individual shot lasts seven seconds in length. So that means the total length of his gadget is a minute and 38 seconds. Okay, so this may not go like the little different thing in the video discussing kits and stuff like that. But I felt it it just works if we talk about the wind delta from last season. As you can see, year one season. You know, year one season 1.2, so that's mid-season. Smoke is a whole lot more popular than Tachanka is, but you have to keep in mind that when you look at it just like this. Tachanka's new, you know, his little little buff that I think should have put him up more, you know, near where... Maybe a zombie a little bit below her, I think, is where he may be. But I think it's because people aren't too open to bringing him. Because when you think of a Tachanka, you still think of, like, the year one Tachanka with the LMG. You don't really think of the new Tachanka that has all those fucking firebombs. And can pretty much stop half of a round if he uses them correctly. So... Looking at here, Smoke is a whole lot more popular, and that's because he is still a very strong and oppressive operator when it comes down to it. He's one of the safest ops to bring if you don't know who to bring. Same with, like, Aruni and stuff like that. Okay, so the major difference between Smoke and Tachanka, besides their kit, is the way that you deploy the gadget. With Smoke, you lob it, and then you can detonate it. Okay? So you can throw it over a wall and detonate it manually, or you can have it pre-placed somewhere to do the detonation. With Tachanka, you have to whip out an entire launcher, shoot it, and it, it's a two bounce then detonation. So you can get more creative with it by standing in a different angle behind the wall shooting it so it bounces. That's a big brain stuff. But the next difference we can talk about is the weaponry. With smoke, you play close with the shotgun and you can play distance with the SMG-11. That shit will tear you up like fucking tissue paper. With the shotgun, you can keep the distance with the LMG. It does shoot slow. But in a game of one shot headshot, it really does not matter on the fire rate that much as long as you can hit the shots. And because it also hits really hard, you can play it out with that. And with the bearing nine, if you want something faster to play closer, you have that option now. They both got the shield, they both make rotate holes. They're pretty much the same op, just a little different gadget and a little different. Alright, so here's the big question Who's really better? Personally, for me, the more I'm thinking about it, Smoke has a better Defender weapon kit than Tachanka has. The M5 and then the SMG-11, they just, 
they, they just hit different, you feel me? It's, it's probably one of the best defender kits overall in the game. But when it comes to the gadget, Tachanka has a better gadget. He has more of them. He can deploy them faster. And they last longer. Well, they don't last longer, but you know what I mean. They'll, they'll last longer. So, th that's how I see it. Both are very good operators. So, th that's how I see it. Smoke better weapons. Tachanka better gadget. Now, who would I bring personally? I'd still probably bring Smoke just because I'm used to him. But that does not mean Tachanka's bad, and I have a lot of hours on Tachanka. And yeah, that's about it. Social media is in the description below. Have a nice day. Make sure to like, subscribe, check out my homie Big Q Capalot. And yeah, see you later.